Hello and welcome back. Today I've got a friend, or rather my boyfriend Jack. Say hello. Hello. Um, Jack has agreed to do the boyfriend tag with me today. Uh -huh. So let's crack on. Okay. Go for it. So I'm going to ask you some questions right. and you've got to answer honestly and then we can like discuss it together. I'm on a game show. You are? It's good fun. A tally ride game show. Tally ride game. Okay. Where did we meet? Did I meet? No. <laughs> <laughs> we met on Tinder actually, which was really good. I was really happy with it because I'm a bit of a nervous person when it comes to the whole meeting girls vibe and the uh, first date I have on Tinder ends up being with we started chatting on Tinder, but we soon exchanged numbers and we did. started texting. But I had to make myself look different, so I came up with a four page story and one text. He did. That won me over. Uh, there was one day when he like made up this story that about South American drugs baron. It was the most yeah. random thing in the world, but it weirdly worked. So what was our first date? So first date was Wagamamas. Uh, Wagamamas in Guildford actually, which is it's a my favourite. Bit of a coincidence because the moment Tally said Wagamamas to me, so I'm thinking first dates, you know, not very good, wasn't like, haven't really been on many, so what do I, what do I do, like, what do I go to, uh, you know, most expensive restaurant in the world, try and be a gentleman, where would you like to go? And then she came straight back with Wagamamas. Wagamamas, I'm a cheap date. I was thinking this seems to be down to the ground, because uh, I'm a massive, massive chicken gas fan. And he still only orders chicken katsu curry. And I still order, only order it. I and it bothers me. But the only the thing I ate on that date was not chicken katsu curry. No, I forced him to try something different because I believe in trying something different every she time said. we go somewhere. Where was our first kiss and how was it? Our first kiss was uh, at Tally's front door. That's another story, but yeah, no, basically. No, it's the same day. It's the same, same day. It's the same night as our first date. And I day. was supposed to, after our first date, I was supposed to be meeting uh, my friends because I always have a bit of a backup plan. Where the backup plan was a lad's night out. It was a lad's night out. <laughs> we got an early space at Wagamama's met there early and ended up leaving when it closed, I think. We were like one of the last people to leave. We just kept talking and I never found someone. I mean, I talk a lot. But, um, Can you tell? But Tally, but Tally I would have edited this because he's talking a lot. But Tally talks a lot <laughs> as well. Okay. So um, I basically said, no matter what, I'm always going to walk her back wherever she wanted to go. But I said, let's go, oh, if you'll fancy it, fancy a few drinks. But she said yes to. Uh, so, so which we still <laughs> randomly do naturally now is we just do the old arm link, don't we? Yeah. So Jack we don't really hold, we hold hands sometimes, but we, we link arms. I, because I didn't want to go for that hold hands straight to relationship mode because I didn't know if she'd like take that. But I didn't want to be like, let's walk along like friends. So he was like, so I was like, I'll take you home fancy on my arm. Holding the arm. That won me over. I that like that. One, right? okay, so our first happened. kiss was outside my front door, um, as Jack said good night, yeah. and then went back on his night out with his friends. Of which I just sat, not sat. I had a bit of a laugh and a few beers, but I didn't really do much because I was pretty much trying to text her. Then he texts me saying, he wishes I was there. Several times. I was trying to be a bit of a smoothie. <laughs> he tried to play it cool and then he got drunk, basically. <laughs> oh, I only one drunk text. <laughs> was... Okay, what was your first impression of me? Donkey killer. No. <laughs> no one's going to get that. That's an inside joke. You're not going to get it. And we're not going to explain it because it's way too long. <laughs> Uh, first impression of in you where sentence. you were, in one sentence, uh, very, very kind. There may have not been anything that was said that was very kind. I, just, <laughs> I was actually a bitch. <laughs> no, you were always really nice, but there may not be anything specific you said that was really nice. My uh, just general vibe. Yeah, I kind kind of just vibe. Got it. Yeah. I kind of thought out about you. My first impression of you. Yeah, this is more important. My first impression of you was so that. He's really not like, just this great guy. Do no, do you know? Way. Me. My first impression of you, you were really kind, really chivalrous. Like the the arm thing was really good, and he was quite the gentleman. And I'd not really met anyone like that before. Um, you just, you know, you're younger than me. You're you're like you're nice and mature. And I I really noticed like the gentleman thing and the fact that we had so much in common. I just thought, who is this guy? We just talked and talked and talked. When did you meet the family? Uh, first time I met family, your family, or your mum, was when we were moving you out of Guildford. Yes, so you were like carrying the boxes, making good impressions. Yeah. Mum loved you because you like packed up the car, and you are very helpful. Kind of nervous. But still so don't want to tread meet, on the toes. When did you meet the rest of my family? You met my sister in London because we went for dinner to phone. Yeah, that was really scary. Food. 
That was Jack found that quite intimidating. But you, you well, like, I sat at a table. I sat, yeah, I sat at a table with like with several girls who are all really lovely, but and bubbly. And bubbly, but they all can talk more than me, which is kind of impossible. She stresses Jack out because he thinks because he he talks. Oh, your brother was probably at your house. Yeah, um, my birthday. I think, I think your birthday or yeah, probably yeah. was your birthday. And your grandparents on the same time. Yeah, Dad sure. loves my granddad. He's a hero. <laughs> he's an absolute hero. He, oh, they get on really well. I think he's a great guy. Do we have a tradition? We think of a tradition we could have. A tradition is um, we do like to go back to our grandmas. That's a tradition, we do. kinda. Like every like on um. So we went to dinner on like the twenty eighth of June. We always remember the day. So like. If it's like September the 28th, if it's the 28th, then we'll be like, should we go to Wagon Mama's like yeah. old times? That's kind of a tradition. Well, some kind we of haven't reason. done that in ages. We did it for the first year, we did like I a I know month what tradition family. is. We love sunsets. We do love so sunsets. So we do like, we do make an games. effort of sunsets and like that's a bit of a thing. That was us. a massive thing. I love them, I've always loved them. What was our first road trip? It's gonna be where we went to the beach, right? Yeah, West oh, Wittering. West Wittering. So, yeah. This is like a date. He picked me up, took me to his family home, and then, and then it was like, so we're going on this big surprise day out, not going to tell you where we're going. And he surprised me and we like drove down to, to the be, beach. It happened to be a lovely day as well. Oh, so. it was the most beautiful day. And the car was perfect, we just drove down there. Jack um, took me to his old school. Yeah, that was on the way. And he showed, he showed me around his old school, and, like his old town, like Chichester. And then we went down to the beach and it was like this boiling hot day and I'd worn jeans and a tank top. Yeah. And um, had not anticipated the sand and the beach. And Jack was like, I'll get the picnic, I'll cater the food. I was like, okay. He picks up strawberries and champagne, <laughs> and that's all we had. Yeah. And I obviously got drunk. And then I, I remember I was just getting that random yeah, like halloumi salad yeah, yeah. on the beach. I was starving. I was like, Back I in always, the day, yeah. I'm always prepared for snacks, and I was not prepared for that. And that yeah. was kind of my fault, but kind of funny in the same way. It was a really good day. It I got was. really burnt. We just sat in the... Yeah, but I got really burnt. We were burnt. I yeah. got really burnt. I felt bad about that as well. Story of my life, I always get burnt. No. Okay. Who said I love you first? Definitely and me. And where were right. we? Right. It was Jack. Definitely me, because I'm an honest person. Especially after a few beverages to the news at work. So yeah. Jack was out for like celebratory drinks. And yeah, I met Tally, she came to meet me. From uh, yeah, we Reading went, or from home from New Yeah, it was like a mistake for the weekend and I like went to yeah. you in the bar and I think I had a few gin teas. Yeah. And we just had a few drinks and we had a really good time and then we were, on, I'm, the, on the I'm way home. I'm helping him walk back. We're on the way home. It was that just, level. No, it wasn't like staggering, but I it could was. talk. I could talk, but I had my arm around there and I was just saying how I was having a very good time in the relationship we were in at the time. I sort of lived for the moment kind of, you know, and yeah. it all comes up and you think I'm really happy It was right quite now. early days. I'm really happy right it? now, drunk with my arm around you, <laughs> staggering home. And it was, yeah, well, I'd say it was early days. It was, it was like September. Yes. We've met in the June and it was September. What do we argue about the most? <laughs> I don't know if I should be honest about this. No, go on. Ali's possibly the messiest person I've ever I'm not met that in messy. my life. I am not that messy. You can see behind the camera right now, <laughs> you would see this abomination of no, it's sweet not that dill bad. to the side of the room. Jack's like anally. No way am no. I anal. I, I am not a student, okay? I'm not a student either. We're not students. I just have more things So I refuse than to live like a student lives like a student. I don't still live like I a student. I do all the washing. But and all the washing. No, you don't do all the washing. Most of the cleaning. We have a clean house. We do have a clean house. <laughs> but mainly <laughs> because, but can I just justify myself just for one moment? Yeah, Bearing yeah. in mind, I leave, the, I leave the house at like before 7am every day and I'll get home after 7pm every day. Mm. And True. therefore like, I'm so busy, I don't have time often. True. So that's Very my true. justification for that. Okay. I'm not good. Who? <laughs> 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 okay. You're <carry>. annoying. <laughs> Who wears the pants in a relationship? I don't think either of us do. I think this is a good relationship because none of us do. We like wear a trouser like each. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'd say that's pretty cool. And we're very chilled people. We don't, yeah. when we say about the argue thing, when we argue, we don't even argue. You just get, you're just like, oh. It's not yeah. even like, there's no, we never, we've never we shouted never, at each other. We've never shouted or had an argument or been really annoyed of each other. No, we don't fall out. We don't fall we out. We don't fall out. We just sort of, Talk about it. We'd I'm sitting in front of the TV. Me. What am I watching? Cooking programs. Definitely cooking programs. Sunday. That sun on the sun. Oh my goodness! I do love morning, Sunday brunch. Oh my god! I love Sunday brunch. It's gonna be cooking. I love programs. Simon. 
Tim. Tim. Who's Simon? I'm yeah, not the <laughs> Simon's the chef guy. I'm not Simon. Either. And I love. Um, <laughs> And what are you watching? Jack is watching Suits. Without me, suits on like, Netflix. Yeah, yeah. Suits. I'm so annoyed because I love top Suits. Gear. Top Gear. Oh, Top Gear's always on. What's the one food I don't like? Um. Because I don't, I don't, I don't if I'm dead honest, I have no idea. I don't think there is anything you don't like. I think you'd eat and try everything. I and think instead of saying you don't like it, you do your great thing like, where you say, it's not my favourite. I wouldn't eat, um, like, I do like it. That's it. Well, if, you, if Jack doesn't like something, I tell well, you he yeah, doesn't like. Mine? Okay, so many things. What? You don't, which doesn't like gravy. Yeah, that's true. Um, that, everyone's gonna think that's so weird. Do you know what I don't like? What? Meringue. I just thought of meringue. No. Not that fussed by it. Like, oh, I'd happily never eat meringue again in my life. We go out to eat, and what do I get to drink? Let's say, a, right. let's say let's say a alcoholic one and a non-alcoholic one. Can so I get two non two non-alcoholics? Because it's yeah, it depends on time. But green tea is a classic for Wagamamas. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But that's, who doesn't get green tea? Yeah, that's true. But it's, you, um, you it's you free. Love, you love <laughs> it's green tea a lot. Water. Well, obviously, yeah. You drink a lot of water. It's good for you. Bitter is good for you. Uh, alcoholic is cocktails because that's all. Yeah. It's all you drink. A specific cocktail? Yeah, the most expensive one on the menu. <laughs> <laughs> Dark and stormy, ginger, gingery things. Yeah. Lime, yeah. ginger and lime. Um, Jack would have a diet coke and Coke Zero. Coke Zero yeah. diet coke. Yeah. And alcoholic. Alcoholic can have a beer. Yeah. But then, alcohol. Are you yeah. gonna make me try to be specific the, on beers as the, well? No, 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 no. Two alcohol or drinks and gin one. Or mojito or gin and tonic. Yeah, yeah. What is my shoe size? You're a uh, five. I am, well, five, five and a half, but I'll yeah, give you that. Five. You are a nine? <laughs> He's an 11. You're an 11. Yeah. <laughs> That's like one crazy thing about me because I'm so short. He's not that short. I'm 5'10, but I've got size 11 feet. So. You know what that, that means, big ladies! Hand, that big hand. <laughs> And big hands, check that out. What is my favourite type of sandwich? Christmas sandwich. It's got to be turkey with the cranberry sauce and the uh, what you eat after your Christmas leftovers in a sandwich. Yeah, or in a wrap. I feel like in a wrap. Oh yeah. But yeah, I don't really eat sandwiches that much. But mm. if I do, Jack's is bacon and egg sandwich. And the other day he did put baked beans in there. But it would be like bacon, fried egg, um, and then for like mayo and ketchup. Ketchup, can't ketchup. put mayonnaise in the sandwich. But he does love mayonnaise. I tell you what, I kind of like a lot of sandwiches. What would I eat every day if I could? You love your salmon. Salmon is actually my all time favourite food. Like, I always get it. That's definitely a big favourite of yours. Yeah. What's mine? Bacon. Yeah, yeah. That's <laughs> bacon. I like bacon. What's my favourite cereal? Oats. Because you don't eat cereal. Yeah, but then you oat like granola. Oats. I oh, love yeah? granola. What is my favourite music? Your favourite music? Your, you have every time we go in the car and put some music on, it's going to be a spin track, a spin workout, a workout. Because they're always like, really like high tempo songs. So you're sitting in the car. I do love like Justin Bieber. Um, so you're very eclectic. Like Jack doesn't necessarily like yeah. one particular band. I do have one. He, like, what's my one favourite song? My all, all time um, favourite song. The one you sang on my birthday. What, oh, and, Maro song? and Maroon 5. Oh. You do love that song, though. I do love it, but no, my favourite song of all time. I've told you this before. I'm going to pay for it. I'm going to pay for it. Is this it. the cocktail? No, no. Peter Clarkson. No, 07. Sing it. Oh, Destiny, God. it's called. Yeah, it's like the IB movie one. It's, right. Okay. Well, you don't oh, know my no. dream song. No, you don't have one. I actually do. Well, let's trade now. What's I yours? really love, do you know what I was thinking about the other day? Your favourite song one, all one, time. One, oh, that's really hard. But I do love Purple Rain by... Um, I feel like I'm just sitting... I was... I was seeing that. What is my favourite sports team? Can we say not sports team, but sportsman? Clue. Andy Murray. Yes. He won today as well. Well, okay. yesterday, beat no back drop it. No. That shows... Okay, well, I've not kept up to date with the tennis, no. but... But yeah, you know, Fun tennis. fact is... I love tennis, but I never play. But Which I love watching gonna it. Teach you. It's gonna teach me. It's my. It's on my bucket list for life. Yeah. What is my eye color? Don't know. Brown. 
Yes. Greeny brown. Are they greeny brown? We have the same colour eyes actually. Yeah. Uh, so. Twins. It was meant to be. Who is my best friend? Me. Actually, that's true. <laughs> no, no, no. That's, that, yeah, but I know. But you are my best friend. Oh. <laughs> you are, though. Yeah. You said that, didn't you? Yeah, it? we did. You're my best mate. You are mine as well. Yeah. Um, your best friend. You've got two. It always, you can't have one. You no, can't I have, one. have one. You've got several, but Jordan is one from school yeah. that you've known for a long, long time. Yeah. Zanna, yeah. Vicky, obviously, definitely. Yeah. And then you've got people from school as well, like who I've only met a few times, not yeah. as many, but like Kelsey. Yeah, and one key person. I know who is. Um, um, you used know. to live with them. No. No, you don't used to live with them. You know, my Scottish home? friend. Oh, Abby, shit. Abby, you know oh, Abby. I, what is I, something I do that you don't like? I'm going to guess. Well, you go, but I think I know what you're going to say. The untidiness is a pretty Yeah, thing. so that's pretty much it. <laughs> it's the only yeah. thing. Because, but the thing is... Also, I, I leave cupboard doors open. Well, that's, but that's part, part of the untidy. <laughs> Thing I don't like that you do is talk too much. Sometimes Jack. No, so so, 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 no, no, no. It's actually a lot. It's quite a lot. <laughs> Basically, Jack loves to rant and rave and like go on. Like if he gets if he gets a bee in his bonnet, he will let me know about it for a good ten minutes. And then, bearing in mind I can speak, I often don't get to like get my point across for a good while. And then he's like, so what have you got to say? And you're like, well, I'm overwhelmed because you just spoken at me. No. You do love I give speak. it a chance. But we're working on it, aren't we? Yeah, we're working on you being cleaner yes. as well. Yes, more we can, but neither of us are perfect. <laughs> no. <laughs> so Thank you. Oh my goodness. Not that I take so many showers a day. <laughs> like, I'm not taking that. that not taking good. that. Okay. How are we doing? We're done. We're done. Did you enjoy it? I loved it. Do you feel like you got to know me better? Yeah, a little bit actually, to be honest. There were some things in there I didn't actually know. So, if you like this video, give us a thumbs up. Hit your thumb up. Yeah, and um, subscribe. And if you want Jack back, then let me know because you're gonna come back. I'll be more than happy. We're gonna to do some do. more like vloggy stuff together anyway. So thank you for watching. Goodbye, everyone. See you later. Bye.